So interestingly, my interest in heart failure began as a medical student and there was the, a drug called Captopril that had been developed initially as a treatment for hypertension. It was an ACE inhibitor, an angiotensin converting enzyme inhibitor. None of us had ever heard of that before, uh, but I, as a medical student, I had read that this might also be helpful for patients with heart failure. And when I was working uh, as a medical student on a ward, I persuaded my consultant uh, to treat a patient with heart failure with Captopril. Now, in those days, that was back in the 1970s, patients with heart failure had no treatment and they died uh, not long after diagnosis. And in fact, many doctors didn't really want to see those patients because there was nothing they could do for them. So we got Captopril, we treated that patient on the ward and this woman got better and went home. And it was amazing to see that happen. So I was really interested in, in heart failure in particular from that time onwards. I then had the wonderful experience of being able to go and see the first presentation of the first trial ever to show a mortality benefits in patients with heart failure, which was the consensus trial with another ACE inhibitor called enalapril. And I saw this uh, physician cardiologist called Carl Swedberg present that trial and I was amazed and I thought, I want to do that. I want to be able to do trials to show that we can save people's lives, make them feel better, stop them being admitted to hospital. And I set out in my career to try and do that. And I've been lucky enough to be mentored and helped and supported by many, many colleagues along the way that has enabled me to do that. I love trying to train young men and women who want to do what I do. I think I've got the best job in the world. I get to look after patients and sometimes I make patients better and that is extremely gratifying. Uh, but I also do clinical trials and I hope that I can change things for many, many patients and and I've been lucky in being able to do that as well. So I'm trying to, to train people to have those opportunities as well.